Hey everybody, this is Big Dave from PerformancePartsCom. We've got our PerformancePartsCom TNT race car, uh, late model stock car that's driven by uh, Kenneth Wilkerson. Today I'm going to show you a new product line that we picked up at PerformancePartsCom. It's R2C Performance Filters. Uh, set the hood off this thing. I'll show you what the filter setup is. R2C has come up with a new filter media that is not the gauze type like on the other name brand filters. They've come up with a uh, synthetic fiber. Um, they're claiming with this filter and this base setup I'm getting ready to show you that uh, they are picking up nine horsepower on the 604 crate motors, which that is what we have in this car. We get this top off. The filter, the media in the filter is a synthetic instead of a cotton gauze type. It's very easy to clean. It's like a, uh, not like the others. You can go and blow this out actually with air, uh, washing it, just soap and water to wash it off, blow it dry or let it dry for 24 to 48 hours. Uh, it's a real free, fro free flowing air cleaner. Also another thing that they have come up with are these dual ceiling rings on the top and bottom of the filter. It keeps you from having to, like we used to do, put grease around the top and bottom to seal out the dirt. Uh, it's a, just a, it's a really neat product. Like I said, it's a, a horsepower gain for your car. Now also, this new pre-filter they've come out with, I don't know if you can see for sure, but it's pretty much see-through. Uh, it doesn't regulate the flow at all. It keeps the big chunks from going into the actual filter. Okay, you notice on this new base they've come up with, the way the contour and everything, it actually directs the airflow into the venturas of the carburetor. It speeds up the airflow, it helps direct it more when it rolls into the intake manifold going into the individual ports. All right, as you can see the difference here, on the left is a standard air filter that you see on most race car applications, approximately two inches taller. Uh, but like I said earlier, with the R2C filter replacing this filter with the R2C, we actually picked up 200 RPMs with the motor sitting here idling. So even though it's shorter, it's a better flowing filter. I'd like to thank you all for watching this video on the new R2C performance filters. Uh, these could be purchased at performanceparts.com. Give us a call, we'll tell you more about them. And once again, remember, for all your performance needs, call performanceparts.com.